Hello, everybody. I'm here today <laughs> filming a YouTube video because I feel like I haven't uploaded in what feels like forever. So, a couple weeks ago, about a week ago, I'm out of breath. I've seen a lot of stuff about this company called Mix Easy. Basically, it's a website where you can create your own face wash, moisturizer, shampoo, or conditioner, and it's like, it'll give you a list of all these ingredients and tells you what ingredient, like what each ingredient is for, and then you get to pick up to six that you want in your um, face wash, moisturizer, whatever it may be. I got a moisturizer from the site just because I have a shampoo and conditioner I love, I have a face wash I love, I don't really have a moisturizer I love at the moment for summertime. I was actually watching Fancy Vlogs by Gab, I was watching um, Gabby DiMartino, I was watching her vlog channel and she basically did a sponsored video with them and I got to use her code. So I got a little bit of money off, so after shipping and handling, this was $37. I have not opened it yet, so I'm going to open it here with you guys. And then um, I'm also going to tell you the ingredients that I put in it and what they're for. And then later on, when it's nighttime and I'm getting ready to go to bed, I will little, <laughs> little <laughs> for you and uh, just show you what I think about it. So you open it and it looks like this. It says unique. And it says, hey gorgeous, Mix Easy team here. By the way, I, Mix Easy, that's the website I did it off of. Uh, team here, we wanted to send you a personal thank you to show This is what it looks like. It's all wrapped up in there, nice and uh, beautiful. Okay, messy. Okay, this is like a small bottle, sorry. Oh, also you can pick your own fragrance, and I picked Honey and Milk, because it sounds like it smells good. The base is for oily skin, since it is summertime, I have oily skin. Duh. You also get to name your bottle at the end. I named my bottle of love. So it's right here, and this is what it looks like. Where does it say bottle of love? Wait. Sorry, this is weird because I was expecting like the list of ingredients to say like only the ingredients that I wanted. There's like a bunch of them, but maybe that's just what they have to do. My name doesn't say it anywhere. My name was supposed to like, my bottle of love was supposed to be on here. Oh well. So, I'm smelling it. I don't smell anything. That's why. It smells fucking good, you guys. It's very thin. It's a thin moisturizer, but that's probably because I said I had oily skin. It feels so soft though. Holy shit, okay. So basically, once it's nighttime, um, I am going to put it on my face and I am going to see if the um, all the ingredients that I said that it was supposed to do, like for example, does my skin look dewy? Does it look brightened after a period of time, so that's what we're basically looking out for. Okay, now I gotta clean up this mess. Hi! Oh my fuck. Could I literally... Every time I think that's a little person, girly. It might be. So, as you saw earlier, got my... Mix easy bullshit. By the way, I'm almost positive. Right down there where it says unique formula, it's supposed to say what I named it, which I named it like bottle of love. Um, it didn't. It doesn't say it, so that's annoying. Mix easy. Another thing that really okay, well, we'll get our thoughts at the end. Right now, basically, I'm going to wash my face like I normally do, and then I am going to come back to you guys and I'm going to apply this and we're just going to talk about our first impressions and everything like that. Um, I think while I wash my face, I'm going to tell you the ingredients that I put into my face wash, but I don't know where I'm going to put my damn camera. 
Oh my god, this is awful. I wanted to have Matt film this part, but he's not home yet, and I don't know when he's home. Okay, and it down. Okay, that's not bad. This is annoying though. I'm going to. Well, you don't care. Hold on. Let me get my ingredients for you guys. You, baby. Oh my god, okay. This is like harder than I thought it was going to be. Okay. So those are my ingredients. God, I have to go through so much stress. <laughs> Alright, I'm back, girlies. Um, so, wrote down my ingredients and then what they do. So, <laughs> hold on. So as I'm washing my face, I'm going to tell you what is in my moisturizer and what it is going to do to my skin. Okay, girly. It's like 8.15 right now. Uh, me and Matt are going to see Incredibles 2. <laughs> 2. <laughs> Tonight, um, we're excited. Okay. So let's just get the face wash going. I've been in love with my face wash lately. This isn't like a skincare routine really, so I'm not gonna like tell you guys what it is, but holy shit. <laughs> the first ingredient or whatever in my moisturizer is Calendola extract, which is basically to calm the skin. It's for sensitive skin, which uh, <laughs> I do believe I have sensitive skin. The next one is Linden Extract. They're all extracts, obviously. That's basically just to brighten the skin. You know, we want our skin to look healthy and bright. And sometimes I feel like my skin doesn't look very bright or healthy. It looks kind of rather dull. So, yeah. Then we have Green Coffee Extract. And that's basically to, like, luminize your skin. That's basically, like, another thing just for, like, healthy-looking skin. Um... Then we have rose hip <laughs> extract, and that is basically to make your skin look dewy. Um, and I live for a good dewy look. Burdock, which is, um, you know, because I do get uh, like acne, so I did want one ingredient in there to have to do with acne. They had a bunch of other like ingredients that you could pick that had to do with acne, but I chose burdock and i just chose one um just because i didn't want the whole thing to be based around acne i wanted other things too um so it just has like healing properties it says which is basically like it said for pimples like dryness eczema just like skin issues of the sorts and the last is aloe vera gel and that is self-explanatory that is just to calm the skin um, and aloe vera is actually really great for your skin if you guys have ever heard that I've been scrubbing this on my face for like two minutes. I need I don't normally wash my face that long In fact normally I get rather bored washing my face So it's funny that I did that for so freaking long because I definitely did not need to Yes, I use towels To take my like face wash off when I wash my face at the sink because I'm not trying to get water everywhere. Uh, the commercials are a lie. Stomach doesn't feel too good right now. My dog is just sniffing the living shit out of me because other dogs, cheater alert. All right, here's what you all have been waiting for. You're dying for it. You're living, you're screaming, you're crying. <laughs> this is it. So here it is, my Mix Easy. Okay, look at how many ingredients that has. That's just like kind of weird to me. But whatever. Okay. So, sorry, had to have my dogs exit because he wanted to make a lot of noise and, okay. I know that's not what you guys are here for. All right, here we go, I'm gonna pump it out. Okay. Looks a sufficient amount. Okay, I want you guys to have like this good of a, like the lighting, but I can't, I don't know how to do that because. Hmm. Okay. Sorry, this is hard because I don't have Matt here to help me. Here we go. Smells good. Okay. 
I'm excited. So right off the bat, um, it's super soft. Um, it's super thin too. I believe the reasoning for the thinness of it is because I said I had oily skin. Um, I definitely do look dewy. Um, I'm kind of like working it into my skin and I still get that dew, which I like. I like this. Right off the bat, first impressions, I like it because... First of all, it does not burn my skin, which is a blessing. Um, there's maybe like like a handful of moisturizers that don't like start just burning the shit out of my skin when I put it on. So that's good that it's not burning. I would hope that it doesn't burn with all of like the like sensitivity that I obviously put in my ingredients. So this is what my skin looks like after. You can definitely see like the rose hip in there, which as I said is like the dewy look. I don't know, I'm super into like the dewiness of it just because like I'm going to bed, it's not that big of a deal if my skin's dewy and I, I just think when your skin looks dewy, you look healthier and I love that, I love the glow. That being said, this is not the true test. The true test is when I wake up tomorrow, am I gonna have whiteheads everywhere? That happens a lot, a lot, a lot with moisturizers. For me, it tends to clog my skin and I wake up with 60 whiteheads didn't have the day before. So that's the real test. So I'll see you guys tomorrow. All right, hi guys. Um, I'm at Starbucks right now. And I thought it would be a good time to give you guys the update on my skin because good lighting and I don't want you guys to have to deal with that shitty lighting. Hold on. Okay. So. I did not wake up with any whiteheads whatsoever. And... Obviously, you know, I have my marks that I have, but my skin looks good. And I haven't been able to say that for a good time now, so. I don't know. I think it looks a lot better. Like, I'm just trying to be honest. I think it looks better. So let's just end this video right here. Is it worth it? Yes, I definitely think it's worth it. You get to make something that's, you know, handcrafted towards you. Um, and I think it's cool because, you know, once it's like winter time, I can change my product from oily to dry. Like I can change it as I please, or I can just keep reordering what I want. So I definitely think you should, guys should go and give it a try. This guy's just watching me fucking vlog. Yeah. Go away, bitch. Yeah, so you guys try, what? Oh my God, I'm so fucking sorry. He's gonna stop looking at me. That's what's gonna happen. He's literally staring right at me. Should I like roll my window down and be like, what? Okay, you guys don't want to deal with this. I know for a fact that you guys do not want to deal with this and you don't care about my fucking road rage so thank you guys so much for watching should you get it you should get it you should try it or don't i don't really care but i like what it did to my skin i will see you guys in my next video Bye.